Five people who live in Gibson County spoke to area plan commissioners during a public hearing at the Gibson County Fairgrounds. Well, neighbors weighed in on a proposed zoning ordinance, which has come up before in the county. Eyewitness News' Amanda Mueller is in Gibson County with more from that meeting. In recent weeks, commissioners got their chance to hear from medical professionals and those in the scientific community. But tonight, neighbors on both sides of the issue had their chance to step up to the microphone. To me, it'd be a moon for the county, really. To be able to see the stars at night without a thousand blinking lights from the wind turbines. The emergence of a proposed wind farm by German company RWE has brought zoning back to the forefront in Gibson County. If this wind project is approved as we know it, then the concerns for the safety of my family will cause me to sell my home. Some in the meeting asking for zoning laws to regulate setback distances for turbines. One is the health and safety of my children, my grandchildren, my neighbors, and my friends. Two is the control of wind energy installations by utilizing safe zones and proper setbacks. Others say it's less about windmills and more about personal freedom. I went to Vietnam for a period of time to fight for another country's freedom and come home to give up my own freedom. And that's what's happening with this zoning. This is not the first time zoning has been a hot topic in Gibson County. I'm surprised that you all have to go through this again. In 2017, commissioners unanimously voted against the zoning ordinance. This is just the latest chapter in an ongoing dialogue within this community. And while we all don't have to agree, let's please remember why we're here. Because we love our homes, we love our communities, we love our way of life, we love our neighbors. About 34 people signed up to speak at tonight's meeting. In Gibson County, Amanda Mueller, Eyewitness News.